The NHS is facing pressure this winter from the twindemic of rising flu and COVID-19 cases, step of fears, a backlog from the pandemic, and worker strikes. Prime Minister Rishi Sunak has been criticized by the opposition over his decision not to recall parliament to discuss the NHS crisis. Health officials have warned up to 500 people are dying each week due to delays in the service. Parliament is due to return from their recess on Monday, January 9, but express readers argue this should have been brought forward. Deputy leader of the Liberal Democrats Daisy Cooper slammed Mr. Sunak and Health Secretary Steve Barkley for being nowhere to be seen during the crisis and urged the government to declare a major incident. She said, this is a national crisis and the country will never forgive the government if they refuse to recall parliament. Labor's shadow health secretary Wes Streeting said the situation with the NHS was completely inexplicable and told BBC Radio 4's PM program that the NHS was actively deterring people from going to AE because they are overwhelmed. Dot. The Doctors' Association UK wrote to the Prime Minister on Wednesday, calling for MPs to return, writing, the NHS is broken. Patients are dying and staff are suffering moral injury from the appalling conditions. We are desperately in need of meaningful action from our leaders and this cannot wait. We therefore call on the government to immediately recall members of Parliament from their Christmas recess to the House of Commons to hold an emergency debate on the state of the NHS. In a poll that ran from 10.30 a.m. on Thursday, January 5, to 10.30 a.m. on Friday, January 6, Express.co.uk asked readers, should Rishi Sunak recall Parliament over NHS chaos? Overall, 1,774 readers cast their votes with the vast majority, 76%, 1,353 people answering, yes, in support of Parliament returning from recess earlier. In contrast, 23%, 410 people, said, no, Mr. Sunak should not recall Parliament to help manage the NHS crisis, and a further 11 people said they did not know either way.